on any who venture into the Crocus Sphinx. Hello there, are you here to help? We've gotten reports that spell-rich stalkers are preying upon any who venture into the Crocus Sphinx. If you could defeat the spell-rich stalkers and find out what's gotten them into an uproar, you'd be doing us proud. discover a magical page of writing. This must be the lost page of frost. The lost page of frost? That must have been what possessed the spell rich stalkers. Nasty business. Ah, so you were looking for the lost page of frost. Handy that. Why don't you take it back to Harold Argleston at the Ravenwood Library? I'm sure he's up to the task of keeping it safe. Page of Frost? Good job! I have prepared a spot in the vaulted archive for these errant pages. Now find Arthur Weathersfield in Ravenwood and ask about Taylor Froghead, the ice student cursed by the lost pages. <laughs> through my contacts that you have recovered the lost page of frost. Tip top! The Carpe Diem Society delved into a book that should have been off limits, and now they are running amok. I've set a mechanism of balance, Dee's mirror, in the Croco Sphinx. Use it, and it will take you to Taylor Froghead. Try to talk Taylor out of her fever. But you may have to duel her to break the curse. Return to me when you are done. You're about to enter a dungeon.
Are you ready to face the sweeping blasts of winter? You'll find no joy here, wizard, until you read the lost pages and submit. Make my body ache, but soothe my soul. Thank you for freeing me.
You talked Taylor Froghead out of her fever? Oh, you broke her curse in a duel? <laughs> well, that works too. I'll get Taylor a frozen custard to settle her nerves. She'll be right as nails soon enough. <laughs>